hi guys welcome back to another video in this video my best friend Annalise and I and her daughter will be going to Disneyland if you're interested in watching this video please keep on watching bus 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 then it in to nine you touch that official bus bus Alright, so if you're interested in going to Disney, talk to people I'm like that you want to figure out. Because we're in Jamaica, you're gonna have to call, right? So you're gonna have to call Walt Disney World, and we have their number. We can. You called Walt Disney World? Yeah, to call. Well, guys, really and truly, I just kind of hitched on to their trip. It was their trip, and she said you could come, and I was like, okay, yeah, because <laughs> I've always wanted to do it. I don't know nothing about the booking. Just he's here to tell you guys all about it. Go ahead. Take it away. So you call, right? When you call them now, you're gonna tell them like if you wanna do. So you have different kingdoms. So you have Magic Kingdom, Animal Kingdom, Hollywood Studios, Epcot. So you're gonna tell them what you wanna do. You have the option to park hop. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't suggest park hopping mm -hmm. on your first run time to mm -hmm. Disney. You're gonna need all the time. So you're gonna need like a day per park mm -hmm. and you're gonna need a day in between each park. Rest. You're gonna need it. So no matter how you feel like your feet, no matter how you feel like you're good, take a day in between each part. Alright, so when you call them now, you're gonna give them your dates and they give you the cost per park per day. Mm -hmm. Then you give them your card info mm -hmm. over the phone and then you give them your card before, info. Yes. You give them that? Yes. On a Jamaica style. <laughs> so on a Jamaica style. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so you have to download the My Disney Experience app. You're gonna download that before calling Disney. Mm -hmm. My Disney Experience app. Mm -hmm. When you pay for the tickets, mm -hmm. that is going to come up in your app. So you know you're going to create your account and you're gonna do all of oh, that. Oh, so when you call them and give them the information. Yes, yeah, so they you have to have, have the, the app, app first. Got it. So when you call, they're gonna ask you what is your email address, what is your phone number, um, your address mm -hmm. and stuff. I used an American address, of mm -hmm. course, and you give them all that information information and then when you pay for the ticket now when you go on your app mm -hmm. you're gonna see you remember when i did screenshot yes. the ticket to you and it on shows it. the dates and everything so everything is gonna be on your you have, have a u.s address on it or you just use that one just I for just preference use, yeah i'm gonna just use my okay. u.s address mm -hmm. just in case so you're gonna see future plans and then all your future plans all your tickets all your stuff are listed in future plans books as well so you need somewhere to stay mm -hmm. you're such a planner because i I never knew you did all these things. Yes, so I just you thought you just need... the thing and just bought tickets. Go ahead, sorry. No. You need somewhere to stay. You have like a spectrum. So you have like really high end places. And then you have like really stay bad places. And then you have nice on a budget place. Yeah. So we stayed at a nice place that fits our budget. Well, my budget. <laughs> Right. We stayed oh, at. Oh, budget. Say, oh, that's so at, not nice. Um, so we stayed at Star Island. It was good. The only thing with Star Island, though, mm -hmm. is you're responsible for everything. Yeah. Food. So food, everything. Tissue. So they have food in all. You can buy the liquid. food in all, but you're yeah. responsible for everything. So your it's garbage. not a hotel. I had to take that because of my daughter's eating habits. Mm -hmm. So I needed somewhere with a stove. If it never have a stove, it can't work. Come have a cook our porridge. Mm -hmm. You can decide, you know, yeah. if what the experience. Because yeah. the more expensive places have like very interactive stuff with yeah. animals and property where the kids can see animals or see like the actual. You can even choose to stay on, on Disney's Disney. property. Yeah. So you know your your thing. Your would budget. Your money. Pass. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mine, but it all depends on what's important to you, your and how you can everything. afford. Yeah, you still can have a grand time without blowing a bag. We had a grand time, yeah. So that's about reservations. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give you an idea of how much I spent. Um, mm -hmm. love this. You came prepared, no, you're, <laughs> you're so. 
You're so prepared. You're such a planner. I'm so happy. Mm. I'm so happy because, guys, I literally just <laughs> bought my plane ticket. That's all. <laughs> I did nothing else but showed up on this girl's trip. How long did we stay there for? Uh, um, five we days. We stayed there for five or six days. Yeah, yeah. and I spent a little over a thousand dollars. A little over a thousand dollars. But for accommodation only, yeah. Yeah. A little over a thousand for five to six days at Star that Island. Really not bad. That's Remember that you. you have to filter in like taxi fare we took uber because i had the uber app so we did uber until her friends got there you know we got rides but and the uber wasn't expensive it was probably like 30 dollars a day the most to go and then come back and then of course you know filtering food costs it's so much cheaper to just buy food and cook than to eat out but sometimes because of how draining the days are you would probably prefer to buy food yes let's just be honest why i love the star island was how close it was to disney also mm -hmm. So you have you have a lot of other places that I loved, but they were further. Yeah. So we stayed like ten, 10 minutes, minutes from Disney. Mm -hmm. So traffic, all of that. Yeah, we, we never had those issues. Yeah, it's so close. And then if you have to take the Uber, then it end up being cheaper. Yeah. Because you have stayed closer, closer. So it's like a closer journey. And also because Star Island is so close, we saw the fireworks every night from Magic Kingdom. Like you could hear it and you could go outside and literally see. Like we were that close. Yes. Yeah, we were that close. No, no, that was But yeah, Star too. Island was a good experience. Yeah. I have nothing bad to say about there. I yeah. give them... It eight, was nice. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. Yeah, I feel clean. like we could have had like a cleaner come in. Yes. But you had to pay for the clean. Off. Yes, yes. But otherwise, it was real good. Nice. Yourself, you have you know, pool. Yeah. You have everything. It nice, nice, nice mm -hmm. place. Nice size room. Mm -hmm. Um, in the living room. So like when Belle gonna sleep, me and Tanania would have been in the living room. <laughs> the you have out, like yeah. the fold out couch. Yeah. Like it was really it was good. good. Uh, balconies there, guys. It nice. Not not do it. Trust me. Yeah. On a budget. Good. You're not going for staying nice in a fancy place. You're going for experience. This yes. Um, yeah. That's was, just the truth. It was real good. I loved it. So that's booking and that's accommodation. <laughs> So remember, get the My Disney app. You mm -hmm. call. They book the tickets. Everything pops up in your thing. You're gonna need somewhere to stay. I personally would say take a day after traveling. So like we to got rest. there this Saturday and buy anything you need to get. Yes, because yes. you're gonna need. So if you stay somewhere like us, you're gonna need to go to the supermarket. Yeah, get food. your food. Get your like a Disney. Every stuff. store had <laughs> Disney stuff in it. Like, and we bought so many Disney related stuff just because we wanted to be prepared. We wanted to match like one of the days also. Them mm -hmm. have a cute little bag, them and a little souvenirs, but they are everywhere. But get it in Walmart, cause everywhere else too there. Yeah. yeah, get it in a Walmart. I same things them oh in a Walmart. Nice. Them just take it from Walmart and I sell it there. I wanted to print shirts here. It will cost me like five four thousand or something dollars for do our shirt. Mm -hmm. And Bell shirt would have been about like three five. How much would yeah. I get the shirt? Them that mm -hmm. It's a ten dollar or something like that. Yeah. And it just say Mom, Mom Mickey, Mini. Mom Mickey Mini, and we wore those. And we had Grandma too. Yeah, they have those shirts, and you have different styles and guys just buy it at walmart yeah it's just cheap. go walmart everything, everything is at walmart ears, so let's just say you even need a stroller you're not have to carry a stroller i mean unless you're that mom i'm not that mom me now walk with the lord so you reach you go walmart you buy a little stroller as i talk about strollers mm -hmm. stroller can be helpful at disney however you it's cannot a lord. take the strollers anywhere you have to park it everywhere yeah, you have to leave the strollers in stroller parks and that can be very very, very, very annoying. Yeah, because everywhere we are going, we have to everywhere stop and apart the stroller. Alright, general information. You can get your stroller. Um, your stroller you at Walmart. have to leave your stroller Anything you have. You go. Yeah, man, Walmart is there. Get it at Walmart. Walmart, they're everywhere. They have everything we need. If you come yeah. in on a panty, go to Walmart. If you have socks, go to Walmart. If you have ears, go to Walmart. When you go to Walmart, I beg you to buy corned beef, bread. <laughs> hey! Buy them things there because. You have a dead for younger pan Disney is this, compound. Is this general info? I think this is general info. It's general, Disney but also was beautiful. Disney was expensive. Disney was sugar tantabulous. It was amazing. Beautiful. However, thirty dollar for I rate that. Disney a zero out of ten for, the for food. food. Yeah, they don't have a lot of Guys, food options. Do and not. It's expensive. Do not. Not even bother wasting the time. Carry your nice little Bad. insulated 
unlimited bag mm -hmm. make your sandwiches freeze your juice yeah. freeze everything that, that your nice baby yeti, loves yeti to eat yeah. and take that with you every single day to disney do not go to disney to buy food yeah it's not your, worth it. It, it it makes absolutely no sense I, oh yeah go hungry because they don't have a lot of options let's yeah, just be clear buy, buy the cute thing what? that we did the, the icicle picture, the cute yeah you can get those cute stuff that's very good but not Food, not um, food. Probably popsicle. Probably you can make hot dogs and bring them to bring your food. sandwiches. Work that that's just an extend yeah. juice mm, based on my idea. Umbrella. <laughs> Get your Sorry. umbrella. Never go without an umbrella. Another thing that a lot of people messaged and asked. Yeah. You know, people want to take like their two year olds, their no. three year olds. No, guys, I'm so Please. sorry. Unless you're filthy rich and you have the money to blow, and they can go again not, when they can not, actually learn. I am not telling you about. Oh, your child won't remember, so it doesn't make any sense. No, it's, you're just legit. Will not be able to do anything, yes. and they will not be able to do anything. Yeah, for, for walk a mile and a half. For all the rights to there is a, a height, height restriction height, yeah, an age an, an age so if they're very tiny they you can't go. do anything you have to sit outside with that child you can't do anything it's, it's a wasted. lot of walking it makes no sense it's a complete shit show <laughs> and i have proof that it can be a complete shit, shit show. show just wait until your child is about six years old or eight that way or eight God, no. that way they can remember the stuff jalice was so frustrated some of the days guys and it's just to be honest i'm gonna feel like she was very excited she, to go yes and she let me tell but you the frustration of the walking and the rain the rain the rain and the up long until lines now, up till now my daughter hasn't forgiven me for her no. um animal kingdom Why? animal kingdom was terrible for her so even though she loved the safari it rained terribly however if you go and your child is of age mm -hmm. and open they can have the world of fun yes i've never Take done pictures. anything with my daughter and 65 pictures yes i've never done anything with my daughter video. that she talks about every single day my daughter gives me a disney memory every single day everything she sees reminds her of disney when she watches yeah. anything on the internet it gives her a flashback of disney it was beautiful it's a beautiful memory to have but don't rush it yeah. it makes no sense to take a two-year-old mm. no matter how a it baby. looks on the internet it no make no it sense doesn't. then cannot do it's nothing a waste. and you can't do anything either because you have to sit outside with, with that child, child. Yeah. no so honestly because my friend her son was direct was about three mm -hmm. and he even when we were going on the thing we were trying to long 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 line for the it avatar? even that she had to avatar. sit down outside and wait on us for so yeah. long um, she couldn't no, no, no. It's still an amazing experience. We will say that Disney's it's, life. I will have to go back because there are a lot of stuff that we did not get to experience. I don't think this is a one-time thing. Yeah. So it's probably something if you have a family and you know you're into family vacations, you could definitely plan Disney trips like every three years or five years or you know something like that. But I do think it's something everybody should experience. Young, old, young, but not too young, <laughs> right? But young and old alike. There's something for everybody. It's very magical. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. And I we I will go back. Fun. I will. Be you back. would have believe say. I give it a ten. Omega Disney. Like I would. I'm at <laughs> I remember when I told her I wanted to go to Disney. She's just like, "Why?" Did I said, "I'm a Disney adult. I'm a child at heart. I want to." Exp I went when I was a kid. I went when I was in pre prep school, but I don't remember many things. I guess I was too young. I was probably six. I don't even. I'm not even sure how old. But my mom took me with one of those school trips. I don't remember a lot. I do remember certain rides though, like that teacup mm -hmm. that was there when I was a child. Mm -hmm. It was because I specifically remember going into that teacup, but I don't remember anything else. So of age now, I'm a friend. So she go at disney i'm gonna send me a go because i can't afford it for myself and i did want that experience like it was good man but no no it was amazing it was guys love save it. your money and carry and do the things. your pitna them listen yeah. 10 out of 10, 10, out of recommend. 10. recommend honestly one of the most beautiful things i've ever we'll done with back. my child it was amazing do it do it do it it's just the truth do it Just, just there. No, at least. 
guys so this is gonna be our day one recap now from the videos you all saw that we did go to animal kingdom which i will state from now was my favorite of all the parks that we went to yes animal kingdom is i think for adults yeah, you've been saying that. Yeah, like, I yeah. honestly the Avatar feel like ride. Animal Kingdom was for adults. It's amazing. The Lion what King I King. loved about Animal Kingdom for kids was the safari ride. The safari tour was oh, the, oh God, that was beautiful. my favorite too. To see the actual Absolutely animals in real beautiful. life. So you're on this train, going through the real life through the, train. I mean, amazing scenery. And the people that we are talking about, the host, tour guys, hostesses or whatever who are on the microphone, like telling, on your left, you can now find the zebra of the beautiful. It was beautiful. So <laughs> my daughter loved that. That was beautiful. But when it comes on to rides now, the <laughs> rides. Our favorite 
ride of all time was at Animal Kingdom, the Yeti. Oh my god, the Yeti is a must do, guys. From where we're posting, everybody was on Instagram recommend. talking about go. Yeah, she was scared. She never did the first one, and I came out and I said, Annalise, come on, we are grown. Don't let anybody tell you that you cannot do it. Let's just do it. Let's just have the experience one time. And she went and she loved it. And she went again. I went three times. She went twice. Yeah. The line for that amazing. one was short, it was and I was very happy because it was a it's amazing yeah it was amazing beautiful 10 out of 10 for the yeti safari 10 out of 10 avatar i'll give it a 10 out of 10 also that was more of an interactive experience but yeah, it was like a simulator the thing. only thing that ruined the day for me and it never even ruined the day for me was the rain guys it rained it every day rain. after that day jalice was so over it because we swak it was a lot of rain the rain was just too much we swak guys we swak so till my clothes that i run one time at one point that's how soaked we were yeah, like it was really Real bad guys real, but real bad. So just remember always have your raincoats always, always have your raincoat umbrellas. always have your umbrella Please. and i mean the raincoat where you use cover your head and like your whole body yeah yeah because there's no shelter there there is no shelter unless you're like in the line for a ride and it's still not like a hundred percent shelter so always have your umbrella always have your raincoat have your water as we said in the general information have your portable fan mm -hmm. if you have like a little rag so you need like a cute little bag to put your stuff in if you are going to bring a stroller just remember you are going to always have to park that stroller mm. <laughs> always it gets very annoying the stroller was folded up and just being pulled and behind us raining, most of the time if it's raining you have, you to, have leave to leave the strollers, in the, strollers in the rain yeah there's nowhere to put them and you are not allowed to bring them inside where the rides are so the strollers are going to get yeah soaked. also if you can go to disney with people mm -hmm. that you love do that so like you and your child and your husband or whoever like if you can go with like a group of people mm -hmm. especially people that have kids yeah i found that that helped my baby so yes, much yes especially because my friend day, yeah. she had her daughter her daughter was like and eight nine mm -hmm. and then her son and that made jelly so much better because yeah. she had people to you yeah. know so then tough it out so instead of her being whiny like mommy i want to go in a stroller she stood because the other child yes, was standing yes so yeah. like she really didn't need the stroller so yeah. that saved me the coming days from struggling with the stroller yeah so go with kids like get a group and go and i think that makes the experience so much better also yes. The amount of bag we're not gonna have to carry. Can they need help with the water back of them? Yo, especially you bring carry the one for me now, man. Your tree bag. <laughs> water buckle everything but i mean yeah oh my god guys and we learned on that first day please wear comfortable shoes yeah, yeah you look fabulous in the picture them but you see because of how far everything is definitely have crocs we ran <laughs> to a croc store we and but we had to get crocs immediately we were cute for the pics but in real life your feet hurt as hell because everything is so so far we did most of the rides i believe that we wanted to do at animal kingdom and just overall we did our most rides yeah that's that's <laughs> us on the floor that's us on the floor in our raincoats when the rain started falling but we did most of our rides at animal kingdom and again like i said it was my favorite my absolute favorite if you guys can tell from the clips yeah, yeah 10 out of 10 you have to do animal kingdom Day two, which is must do since you're already there. You have to go to Disney Springs. Wait, so day two so was our Disney we Springs day? Didn't. Yes, we did not go planning on Disney Springs. Yeah, we didn't. I don't even knew this. I didn't know what Disney Springs was either, guys. Yes, I, like I said, I but didn't. my 
daughter's uncle was like, oh my god, you guys have to go to this place. This was on one of our down days also. Yes, and this was when on we our should have been rest day. Yes. So, um, he was like, Disney Springs is beautiful. There's so much to do there. We had the time of our lives yeah. at Disney Springs. My I'm gonna daughter all the clips. loved Disney Springs. Yeah. It was magical. So it, big, pretty. Pure Mickey Mouse balloon. You could shop too, also if you're at the stores. So, like, if you want to get the coach, the the, the coach vibe oh, that you see all thing. the people doing with, yeah, yeah, the, yeah, um, with the Disney the logo N things. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think the lady said that on the two of the stores. In, Do that, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, so, I mean, it's beautiful. You have like the Zara stores. You have so many stores there, but Lego, the Lego store. The Lego the Lego store, beautiful. the M&M store, beautiful. Loved all of it. Be like the bowling beautiful. alley, the restaurant, we the, the Planet cinema. Hollywood. Ooh. It was beautiful. Our favorite thing and one of our favorite memories will always be the, the hot, hot air, air balloon. balloon. It was absolutely amazing. Yes, beautiful. It was. The scenery. Beautiful. Beautiful. It took us what about twenty minutes to get onto it in yes. the line. It wasn't long, guys, and it was not expensive I either. I think it was fifty dollars for adults Probably, and yeah. about thirty dollars for kids. Yeah. Um, you know, you can buy the little bubble machine and the stuff yeah. like that for your kids. It's definitely nice. The hot air balloon was beautiful. Balloon. Also, we did it in the night. So that was even prettier because you saw it the was lights. It beautiful. But not a lie, when we did up there and the breeze start blow the balloon, like me, I said, Jesus got supposed to something then bust off. I will fly away. But we mm. went up safely and we came back down if safely. If you have a son that's into um, dinosaurs, they have oh, yes, like the they have a dinosaur store restaurant where you can go. You can like while you're eating the dinosaurs, like yeah, and you're hearing the sounds and yes. the, the drooling on the shoulder. Uh, like a big yeah. I guess T is gonna show you all, but yeah. you see, it's like a whole. That's a T. You can never see it good, but I'm gonna put the, the clip. The store was exceptional. So take your kids there; they will enjoy. You so that's not Disneyland. That's in. Disney Springs. That's Disney. Springs, that's like a mall, so not but Disney. it just has a lot of interactive things there. Not Disney, but amazing. Very good. Nice scenery. Nice things that I can see. Things that they won't forget if you want Lovely to make memories. it like a memorable vacation. Yeah, that was day two. <laughs>
You see you can't shoot run a one time. Was it? How was it? I, I told you guys. Right, out of ten. Out of ten. Million. Million. See, and she didn't want to go. She thought she was gonna be afraid of roller coasters, and it was amazing. Oh my God! Look at Annalise who did not even want to do roller coasters. She wanted to go again. The the wait though was two hours, so definitely no. We're gonna try to find something else and see. Let's go on the horses. Okay. Hopefully the horses line is not long. Oh, love it. Day three. Day three was Magic Kingdom. Magic Kingdom. I don't know. I think Tanania hated Magic Kingdom. I just thought it was going to be more than what it was. When That's... we got there, she said the place looked all oh, shit terrible. Bad. Guys, it have an old look for true, like old town thing. The buildings are red. I don't know. It just never gave me a pause. However, however, it was beautiful. I think. That's where she cried, as you guys saw. Yes. She cried on the, the roadside. Parade. The parade was my favorite. 10 the out of 10. Parade. Most experience. The parade. Had to experience. The Beautiful. Parade. Jesus. Wow. Loved. I cried. She cried. Good. It was everything my daughter had at time. You don't have to do all the parks, you know. No. You don't have to do all the parks. You can choose, you know, the parks that are important to you. So, if you are an adult and you want to have fun, mm -hmm. you do Animal Kingdom. And because at Magic Kingdom. It's very, very kiddy. Yes. However, we went on the pony ride though. We enjoyed ourselves. That yes, was that so, was Jalice's park. So yes, so Jalice loved Magic Kingdom, Wasn't and that I think that's why did... most people go to Magic Kingdom. That's where you get the the castle in the back and you take the pictures and the fireworks okay, in the night. Our favorite ride. What what about the Seven Dwarfs? That's too. what I eat, that's <laughs> like I tell them about. The Seven Dwarfs was beautiful. It was. One thing about Disney, I think the rides are short. Yes. So what I suggest you do is get the Lightning Lane Pass. It's about $25 per day. Mm -hmm. You get that. Then you don't have to join the long lines where you're waiting 45 minutes, one hour, one hour, like 30 minutes. minutes. Or probably 15, you don't 10, have to or wait, no wait. at all. Because a lot of persons don't buy it. Yes. What's messed up is you have to buy it from the app from before. You have to use the app, guys. You have So you can't go there and then decide to want the Lightning in Lane. Disney is done through the, the app. app. That's what I'm going to tell you. Just make sure you get the Disney mm -hmm. My Experience app you're gonna need it so once you want to go to disney you just get that because when you go and you tell them you want it you're gonna have to go seven dwarves beautiful 20 out of 10 recommend she beautiful. loved it it was amazing the pony ride was cute my daughter also loved the ride i hated the most which was um Wait, which ride was that what's this again a it's a park? small world oh i almost I fell asleep on I that actually boat. remember it's a small world when i was a child too you know i remember the singing yeah i do yes, yes. yes like you're on a boat it's just just very simple. Remember me to lay a good little job asleep. My daughter loved it. We, that's why we did the Peter Pan one it. too, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. you have the Peter Pan rides. Mm -hmm. If you stay until night. So when you go to Magic Kingdom, that's where you're gonna stay until it's very late. At nine o'clock. They have the fireworks. They have the fireworks. We missed it though, because we were on one we of our on favorite rides. Space Mountain. Space Mountain. Don't it's take almost. kids on Space Mountain. Yeah, Space kids, Mountain kids cannot is, no. It Adult. is pitch black. Your neck probably will need a cast I when you're done. I loved it. But it was amazing. It was amazing. 
<laughs> you have scream, scream. It was amazing. You have to do Space Mountain. So because the line was so long for Space Mountain, we ended up missing the fireworks because fireworks. it's enclosed. Yeah. So while we're inside going in the line or going through the line waiting to get onto the ride, we miss all the fireworks outside. But I'm not mad at it. I really am happy I went on to Space Mountain. The it's, castle is beautiful. The castle is beautiful. Oh, the whole God. place, that the whole Magic Kingdom is pretty in the night. I prefer it's, it in it's, night. It's and pretty in the day. magical. That, I guess that's why they call it Magic Kingdom. Real good. Oh, where all the dreams come true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely but, do a Magic Kingdom. Ooh, another tip, guys. When you're starting the park, ensure to get the map. Mm -hmm. So the map has all the lists. It has a list of all the rides and where you want to go and how to find every place and everything. Get the map so you can walk up and down and decide earlier on where you need to get to while you're not just walking aimlessly bucking up into different different areas yeah you literally can look and say okay this is what i want to go you could even google the places from before and then check on the map and say okay yes i saw that they said magic kingdom is amazing where on the map can i find magic kingdom yeah because there are not really that many people to stop and ask for directions really and truly yeah everybody there is everybody just there, as there, as yeah you. them last like yourself too there are not people on the roadside you can stop and say hey where is this no <laughs> intention doesn't happen Okay, so day four, which is... So I made a mistake and I booked <laughs> Universal Studios on the Disney break day. Tired. Would I Listen, kill me? my friends Wait, were which... like, they're not coming. They are toast. So it was me. Mommy never come either. No. My mom was exhausted Tired. from... Um, Our feet were killing us, but we decided that we had to go. We decide, say, we are going. Me, she, and Jalis alone, and Jalis session now go pan the big people right there. Me and Annalise just walk So because Jalis refused to do all the scary rides, thrill seekers didn't get to get to seek any thrills. Yes, yeah, so we were on a pure to go 3D ride, 3D um, minions so. and fool things. <laughs> She got so Pure frustrated. She sat outside on the ground and leave me alone to do all the Simpsons, Indian baby ride. It's them. just one alone should have by herself, guys. And it was the Simpsons. The line was way too long. I was like, no, this is ridiculous. And that's the one that Jalees loved the most. I must have three times Jalees ended up doing the Simpsons. That oh. lady was so nice. So every oh, yeah. time Jalees came up, I was like, oh, can I go back? And he was like, okay, can I go back? Because I just waited on them on the outside. Yeah, but it was beautiful. Universal Studios is amazing. So you Universal does the movies that Disney doesn't do. Mm -hmm. Spongebob, Transformers, Transformers, Harry Simpsons. Potter. Oh my god, guys, I really wanted to go on the Harry Yo, Potter ride. Yo, it's so Oh wait, or is that, was that on the day? Was Harry Potter on the... No, no it was Universal. there. It's there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like that had some crazy the mummy. So Universal Studios to me now is um, more for grown folks too. Probably like teens. We're gonna have to go back. But there are a lot of rides for babies there too. So the park 3D. is split in two. Remember, she told us that one yeah, side, yeah, yeah. one side, yeah. and one yeah, side yeah, for yeah, the yeah. kids. Mm -hmm. So it's split in two beautiful place universal definitely had better food options yeah they did yeah as you enter pizza, you have hot pizza dogs, you have like food pastas, options like universal yeah there was food yeah universal was good for food way better mm -hmm. than disney way better than disney i don't know what disney is doing with food i don't know either but universal was good it was good my daughter loved it so you definitely can do universal but you did not Studios. love it because we could not We're go on any ride We're but the, to little, go the little 3d rides them did nice though them really never bad but you know jelly's did happy from me get good. a from me get a taste of yeti you decided that you needed thrill and you did not get on the first one yeah Universal. i did mm -hmm. avatar is very good so you should do avatar right? avatar from first day girl from 
those are from Animal yeah. Kingdom. My shade of the Avatar. Yeah, it's included in Eclipse. Yeah. But definitely, we did not get any thrills on that day. Mm -hmm. We're going to have to revisit yes. without any kids, yeah. or at least when Jalice is older, yeah. and we'll want to do it. But Jalice or is such a I grandma. Had her. <laughs> she don't want to do those rides. Yes, she, she wasn't gonna have it. God. You see, like if you can afford to take somebody to guys, like how my mom was there. Yeah. So all right, so we never wanted to do anything without each other. That's right. So when my mom is there now, then you know she I have somebody to keep jealous. But when it's me, she and Jalice I'm not gonna alone, go on the ride without yeah. Annalise. It just is not gonna work. And yeah. Alice and I'm um, Jalice not gonna sit there by herself. Yes. Yeah, so, so we just don't do anything. Work, so we never did. We just walk up and down and look. Well, but it's beautiful it's guys. beautiful it's very pretty very and i'm good. full of store where you can buy stuff so every ride they come off you go through the gift shop yeah so every i love that so I like let's like just that say also. you do a minion ride yeah. where you exit you have the minion plus full of minions. the minion earrings minion minion sweet tea, minion slippers Yo, i bought a bottle of water for six dollars fifty at universal studios and never forget that that I hope you keep the plastic bottle six dollars and fifty cents for a bottle of water when we tell enough for freeze but we are dead we are dead guys we didn't food. need it me are no we were blue. dying it was so Take hot my advice hot and the fan them with them have a blow at air and like at universal the, it was not have no shade like disney so you're literally standing in the sun waiting in the line to go into the ride yeah. terrible yeah. but hey yeah. what we did we did the no the minute that wasn't the many black which was it was transformers, transformers. we did no, transformers no the ride them cool and all it's the ride are very they're but very, they're not outside it's not a roller coaster you know what i again it's 3d about the rides. it's like everything they make everything an experience yeah the and i think that's what water blow up and we the breeze water blow up and you um like they might talk to you so like let's just say you step in a room mm -hmm. you hear boom yeah back of you. so it's the not whole, like it you the waiting feel. line too it's give it starts giving you the experience from your waiting in the line yeah. so you're seeing all the stuff from you the can't movies be bored. yeah you're hearing like they're talking to you about, it's that's true you're correct yeah. so you weren't waiting bored in the line there's something to look at yeah. it's just that the wait time is just very long yeah. so you kind of get frustrated yeah, I'm not telling the light, I think we waited to add yeah, definitely mm -hmm. do the pass the lightning yeah. anyway i go always take the convenient thing so if them say them have something we're gonna make you cut the line take it yeah. nobody go go play hero and get zero boy you're waiting a line it cuts the time that you get to ride the rides by so much and the yeah. frustration and yeah. the tiredness start coming down playing at the line and yeah. you just give up and want to go home and want to lay down right. but again we're gonna revisit that yeah. yes please yeah, thank you okay great all right guys so the last day last we did, day Hollywood Studios. Hollywood Studios is beautiful, by the way. Really, really beautiful. It was one of my favorite parks. As in the scenery but, or the park itself? Yeah, like just the park itself. The rides, everything, it was really good. And it had some amazing rides that my baby liked. So Hollywood Studios is very kid friendly. However, because I didn't skip a day, so I was going Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. I was wiped. And I didn't come. I didn't come, guys. They were going to go ahead. That depressed And me. I would have come meet them. But, you see, by the time I text the woman and say, we want to see you now. The woman said them sit down on the roadside. Yeah. It, it was. put up on them. Yeah. Like, we were wiped. We were wiped clean. We couldn't go any further. So, we left about 4 o'clock. But it had some amazing, amazing rides. I never ended up going. So, um, she's the only one talking about this. Okay. Even like the Toy Story ride, it was very Is it that, that's good. 3D? That was a 3D ride also, like Look the Minions. Look oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's, like a, it's like a roller coaster. Mm. Yeah, it was beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, you had like this ride where you're on this train. This was one of Belle's favorite rides. The Mickey Mouse thing. So it's like it has like train rides. It has nice rides for very kids. Very simple kiddie rides. Yeah. Very but kids. It, it was very good for kids. We just had no energy. And that's why I tell you, like, take a day in between, in between and actually rest and get rest yeah. yes and so like you know here they had like this lovely lemonade and if you ever go get the fruit popsicle so get the they can see it they can see get it. the fruit popsicle very 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 yeah. very good um the lemonade the popcorn i enjoy those at, so that um, them them up there popcorn uh, fruit sticks yes and always else. remember to get your map as t said you're gonna need the map to help you get around mm -hmm. 
oh. quickly and efficiently yeah i just wish like for me like instead of always walking i wish they had like, a little carts thing or like a train that went around that you could you know and it stops at every stop so you can come off instead of having to walk but again that's probably a part of the experience for you and your family walk together yeah i think and everything. you guys could park up if you do like a week right you could park up on this day mm -hmm. hollywood studios you could park up to epcot mm -hmm. epcot i was told is more for adults and it has like you're drinking in different countries or different cities i think or something like that so with these little trains that th these little thing on the line in the sky that's what takes you from hollywood studios mm -hmm. to epcot so you could park up on that day but don't park up on any other day <laughs> no the other parks are way too full yeah. i feel like as i was saying like with the trains thing okay yes the ride maybe the walking Mickey together. and Minnie's runaway railway oh that's the one that she likes your baby will love that okay. yeah was really good. i never went like i said guys i, I don't know what she's talking about but mm -hmm. yeah they definitely said that the one and two things they did on that day was good but i feel like they should just make the getting around the park more efficient but maybe that's why they do it that way so you'll have to come back because you clearly cannot you clearly you clearly cannot finish everything in a one day so they end up forgetting money because you have to come back another time another time another time so that's probably their way of being smart i don't know but it's a lot of walking yeah that's why you have people um going back all the time you have people yeah. that go so like i'd go back when bella's about nine ten yeah so i don't think she'll care like as a teen yeah walking and stuff like that yeah and then in the airport what i liked when we were leaving is like they had like the disney store yeah they had a disney store you could still get more more stuff if you wanted more memorabilia or whatever and, and then because they were turned what they turned 100 yes yes so they had a lot of 100 year old memorabilia it was just nice and they had like a lot of water parks too so actually my regret oh. is doing only one week i definitely should have done two weeks what was the park we were going to try the sea water world. park we're going to try sea world guys yeah, that's so outside like of disney in the airport yeah but these parks are like what a hundred dollars so they, they have these so things expensive. that mimic the parks mm -hmm. like all the parks in the in, airport yeah mm -hmm. and it was really really good yeah love it i give it 10 out of 10 yeah even though the rain and stuff and the walking Jeez. but it's 10 out of 10 it was so bad <laughs> I'm gonna mean a little juice I'm gonna mean it's a pour, you know. Tra. Like it was a storm around there. Tra. Me I wonder if we did have some clips in there with it. Probably <laughs> not, but just know that we were soaked, like absolutely soaked. It's a good thing we didn't have curly hair. She did have her hair catch up like this, say, no, say. Our natural hair stands free cut from the top. Yeah, it's bad, my ear. Yes. Yeah, my hair. You have to wear low maintenance hair, go ahead and place the guys. Yeah. Catch up your ear or have like a curly hair where if it get wet, you're okay. Alrighty. Because some of the, the rides are wet, right? What is so if you go to Disney World dot Disney dot go dot com so you can see like the parks right when you're choosing like your tickets and like you can see so for oh, so in july so like on july 13th to go to whichever park this was it was about 144 dollars mm. for oh. one ticket so it shows you on the per day person mm -hmm. per park mm -hmm. please remember that it's one ticket per day per person per park and it tells um, you the time too yes it tells you the time so you can see where it says one park per day it says please select the park you will visit if you choose a different ticket type such as park hopper no park selection is required because then you're buying a different thing to hop from park to park mm -hmm. don't recommend don't recommend hopping from so park to park. so like you can see magic kingdom was was approximately 154 dollars mm -hmm. epcot 144 hollywood studios 149 and animal kingdom 144 dollars per ticket per person per day mm -hmm. yeah y'all got that y'all got all that info you got it y'all waited on this video a while so i'm happy if you guys are happy and remember guys if you do go to disney you know take a lot of photos live in the moment try to record as much as you can while still living in the moment because we have these memories for a long time i can't wait to drop the disney content for you guys if you have not followed me yet follow me on instagram at tanani and follow her on instagram at annibaliza and also follow her store pages at shop annibaliza and baby bells closet you could also send her messages she's not like me she's very friendly i joke <laughs> 
She will answer your questions. Answer she will. I don't know any information, so I can't tell you nothing. Like I said, I don't know. Right? So that's why I had to do this video with her. But thank you always again for bringing me along. You know, long more for Tilly Tongues. It's yeah, awesome. it's it was amazing. It really I'm was. I'm happy you made my, I, I you made my so life. I'm so happy you came with me. I, I really appreciate it. That. Yeah. That I'm so happy the day you said you were going and I said, I'm coming. And she said, okay. Belwanga Paris. <laughs> So she wants to die for Thomas. I look at job because at the rate at which Jalisa live for her life, I forgot to get to work. I can't afford it. Uh, yes. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any more questions and you want to leave them down below, definitely go ahead. If we can answer them, we will. And by we, I mean her. Yeah right but comment below let me know what you think if you've been to disney what's your experience and what park is your favorite like the video share to your story so we can repost it and if you do go to disney and want to tag us in those stories as well we will definitely repost them you can subscribe to this channel and we will see you guys next time bye, bye guys.